Hey, what is up everybody? Epitome here, and today I got another CSGO video for you guys, and today I wanted to talk about matchmaking and matchmaking ranks. Now, a lot of people have been deranked, and a lot of ranks have been moved around, and they really have made it harder to get global. I mean, there's pros out there that can't even get global. Take Steel, for example, he's supreme right now. Take Shroud, for example, he's also supreme. And I know they don't play matchmaking a lot or as a whole, but they normally would get global right away. So they have definitely made it harder. I mean, like a few of them haven't even played matchmaking for years and years and years, which makes sense. I mean, they mostly play on ESA or SIBO and face it. I'm just using them as a main example because I, ha I do watch their streams and I have seen their ranks and stuff like that. And when they have played matchmaking, it is kind of tricky for them to get global. Not necessarily hard, but they actually have to work for it rather than just getting it right away like bam, boom, done, global. Now, with this rank change it really based it off of gold no four that is like the average rank that's the average player rank right there and i mean they made it a bell curve and everything and lem i mean supreme and global are honestly a lot harder to get than they were before i was lem before the rank update now i am le and i mainly have a question for all you guys out there i know a lot of you do play matchmaking so i do have a question for all you guys do you guys think ranks mean more now since it's harder to rank up, since it's harder to get that higher rank, do you guys think that ranks actually mean something now? I mean, before you'd always hear people say ranks don't mean shit, ranks don't mean shit, ranks don't mean anything, blah, blah, blah. But now, since they're harder to get, since they quote unquote, it proves more skill to get, like it takes more skill to get. I'm putting air quotes around this. You guys can't see it, but I'm putting air quotes, okay? I mean, do you guys think that it is harder? I my personal opinion i don't i don't i don't think it means anything i don't i really don't because matchmaking the way matchmaking is it's every man for himself every person solo queues even when you have a team of five it's not played like a scrim would be played it's not played like a real match would be played it's played every man for themselves yeah you play a little strats like oh everybody rush b you know i'm gonna go say overpass everybody rush b i'm gonna go down connector that's it. That's that's your strat for the round. It's not in depth or anything like that. Everybody runs around, does their own thing, tries to pick up the kill, tries to trade the kill with the teammate if they can or if they're there or if you even trust your teammates. And then, I mean, you may win the round, you still may lose the round even if you work together. I really feel that it ranks still don't mean shit. Ranks do not mean anything by any means. It what I mean, what ranks are, it's just what you aspire to get. Like, what you try to get, what you feel good being that rank. I mean, ranks are just, it's just an item put there to feel better about yourself. That's honestly what I feel like it is. But I want to hear your guys' opinions in the comments below. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. My name's Epithemy. I'll catch you guys with some more videos later on this week. Hey, if you guys enjoyed this video, definitely be sure to leave a like. If you guys want to see more videos, definitely be sure to click one of the links in the description to go watch more of my videos. If you guys always want to see more, then definitely be sure to subscribe. My name is Epithme. I'll catch you guys later.